Praise the Lord and good morning to you, dear beloved. Once again, the gracious Lord, we have found grace upon him, and he has given us the gift of life. May his name forever be praised. We thank you, Almighty God, for your love and for your concern for us all the time. We thank you that you provide all our needs and you care so much about us. We bless your name this morning because it is only by your grace that is why we are alive. We thank you for your everlasting favor and we thank you that indeed you are eternal God. There is no one greater, powerful than you. You are the same yesterday, today and forever. Your name is Almighty God. May your name be praised. And Shall we go through the word of God once again? In Psalm 37, delight yourself in the Lord, and he shall give you the desire of your hearts. Commit your ways to the Lord. Trust in him, and he shall bring it to pass. Praise the name of the Lord. So I will start by the fifth verse. It says, commit yourself unto God. Trust in him. Child of God, listen. When God say that, I know what you are going through, and therefore, give me what you are going through, that pain, that sorrow. Yes, then he knows what he's talking about. And so the Bible says that trust in him, believe in him, know that whatever that he has said, he will surely do it. And the joy is that he will grant unto us all the desire of our hearts. This morning, what is your pain? Is it joblessness? Is it a matter of you are believing God for something great? Are you believing God for open doors, blessings, supernatural grace? Are you believing God for a healing? Are you believing God to get yourself delivered from all the attacks of the enemy? Yes, God says he knows it all. And so just trust in him. And when you trust in him, he will give you the desire of your heart. This morning I pray the same God who told us that we should learn how to cast all our burdens onto him because he cares for us. May he give you the desire of your hearts. Because he said, whenever we commit our ways unto him and trust in him, he will surely bring it to pass. Remember one thing, that whatever that you have cried unto God for, whatever that you have struggled, remember God will surely bring it to pass because he has said it and surely he will do it. And open so, baby, I can hear you, I can hear Nini mu and nine in no ho or say Mawaninka a rade home na a be mawa ni awa kuma pe. Fawakwa in yina sha raden sa na fa hotono so is anse obema nini na abem. Nyan of kai se me kai was se a rade se uni minya w ne mu and inti fao hao no dagin yina breno. And in Psalms, you only can say, John, you only can say, my own income is ready home. GD, when you meet your own name, when you meet your own son, when you meet your own son, when you ask for dinner, when you cry, aye, when you meet the waywardness, when you are at your party, when you meet your car, when you meet your car, and that also, and so you all can say, it's not so I want the intimacy. Christ was telling me, I said. Fatunin semano. Na o se obe mawo nye wa kuma pe na wa sheni dieni mu nyam ewa wa sitrimu. Ano pe yi nye wa ka e jina no shensu e bemono. Oma ni mre mu ema wa sitrimu. Isan se o yu nyame. Hallelujah. Na o se obe ma nye wa fifi nye na 
Peace,